Did you know that you can check your thyroid gland at home in under one minute with just a glass of water? I'm gonna teach you how to do it right now. Step one, get a glass of water. Step two, stand in front of a mirror. Step three, find the base of your neck where your thyroid gland is located. Now for most people, that's going to be the bottom one third. Okay, so if you're gonna split your neck into thirds, it's about this area. Step four, you're going to take a small sip of water. You're gonna lean your head back and swallow. Now, as you do this, you need to be looking in the mirror at that base of the neck I just taught you about in the previous step. What you're going to be doing is as you swallow, you're gonna be monitoring for lumps, bumps, or any inconsistencies in the thyroid gland. And I'm gonna show you how to do this in just a minute, but I wanna explain what you're looking for first. I'm gonna demonstrate how to do this now. As you swallow, your trachea is going to move up and down, but because the skin is staying static, that movement of the thyroid is going up and down underneath the skin, which means if there are any inconsistencies, you will see them reflected as lumps and bumps underneath the skin. Step six, you're going to repeat this as many times as you need, probably three or four times, just so that you know what you're looking at. Step seven is optional, but if you find anything that looks lumpy or bumpy, you can gently palpate the area. But don't press too hard because you can actually press out thyroid hormones if you aren't careful. You'll know your thyroid is healthy if you don't see anything at all. That's what you're looking for. If you see any lumps or bumps or inconsistencies, that's when you wanna to go to your doctor. What does this thyroid gland check tell you? It really only gives you information about the anatomy of your thyroid gland. And it's looking for things like thyroid cyst, thyroid nodules, thyroid cancer, and even an enlargement of the thyroid gland, which we call goiter. It will not tell you about the function of your thyroid gland. In other words, if you wanna to check to see if your thyroid gland is producing thyroid hormones, what you'll need to do is get your thyroid labs tested. And if you wanna learn which thyroid lab tests are needed to test your thyroid, then I'd recommend checking out this video next.